We have shown you several experiments that deal with air pressure, and we are going to do an air pressure experiment today that looks sort of like magic. Never do that again, Siegfried and Ray. Our atmosphere is always pushing on us in all directions. Containers that seem empty are actually filled with air. Even when you turn that container upside down, it's still full of air. Even when a container is full of something else, like water, air is still pushing on it. Hate to break it to you, but a glass of water is not magic, Radini. Radini? The physics creates the magic when we put our experiment together. For this, we need a playing card and a partially filled container of water, but that container needs to have a mouth that's smaller than the playing card. We set the playing card on top of the glass. This looks like it could get messy, so make sure you do it in a place that can get wet. While holding the playing card on top of the glass of water, quickly flip it upside down. Now let the card go. How does it stay there and the water doesn't come out? That's the magic. Or the physics. Since there is no air in the glass, air is still trying to fill that empty space created when the glass was turned upside down. The air pushes the playing card up against the glass, holding the card in place and keeping the water from spilling out. What happens when you slide the card away? Exactly what you'd think. It will allow air to move in and the water will spill out. So there's a little physics disguised as magic. Please don't do that, Raven Copperfield. Raven Copperfield, reporting from home. I'm Elizabeth Petlin. And I'm meteorologist Ray Petlin. <laughs> <laughs>